I've heard a lot about you, Commander. The Dominion always portrayed you as a criminal, terrorist. There's more to you than it seems. Well, with the Dominion being what it is, someone's gotta stand up for the little guy. It sure ain't gonna be Mengsk. Doesn't seem like the Emperor cares at all. My people from Agria, and displaced populations from across the sector, have all fled to a refugee staging area on Meinhof. There are reports of violence and disease spreading throughout the camps, but the Emperor's done nothing. I'll look into it, Doc. Just out of curiosity, I did some tests on the minerals from Redstone. I thought you should know I found trace quantities of Jorium, a rare crystal with very unique properties. I'm all ears, Doc. What kind of properties? Jorium resonates at the same frequency as certain brain waves. It's been theorized that it could be used to stimulate brain activity, or even produce psionic abilities in human subjects. What the hell does Tosh want that for? I'm working on a cure for the Zerg virus. I just hope my people won't need it. I've run a few tests on the terazine gas like you asked. It's clearly related to Vespine gas, but there are some very exotic organics added into the mix. Any guesses what it's used for? Well, it would definitely affect brain chemistry, so it could be used as some kind of drug or stimulant, I suppose. Drugs, huh? That's just wonderful. I see we have a new acquisition. Is it a Protoss device? That's right. But I wouldn't mess with it if I were you. It's a Kaderan Ehan crystal. It's a memory storage device. It lets you experience what other people have seen or done. It can be dangerous if you don't know what you're doing. Yet you don't fear it at all. You're a fascinating man, Jim Rayner. You know more about the Protoss and the Zerg than any of the experts I've read about. I'm okay, Doc, before you start asking. You were staring at that Protoss device for a very long time. Are you sure? Well, now you mention it, I could use a drink. Or two. Maybe what I saw would make more sense if I was drunk. What was it, Jim? An old friend of mine. Looking for the end of the world. Jim, let me in. What really happened on Tarsonis? Whatever it was, I can see it tearing you up inside. Tarsonis. That's where it all went down. Meng stole a psi emitter from the Confederacy and planted it there. He knew that it'd attract the Zerg and... Our revolution began that day. The day Mengsk murdered a whole planet and called it justice. My god. Billions of innocent people. That's... That's just... Monstrous. No wonder you hate him so much. A lot of rumors going around. I'm guessing you've heard plenty about me and Kerrigan by now. Are the stories true? That Manx just... Abandoned her to the Zerg on Tarsonis? Her. Plus a few billion innocent civilians. After that we knew exactly what kind of man we'd been dealing with. I don't care much about anything anymore. But the one thing I hold on to is seeing Manx brought to justice before I die. Jim, I've been investigating the claims that Nova made about the Spectres turning into psychotic killers. So what'd you find out? Honestly, there's no evidence that Spectres are any more prone to aberrant behavior than ordinary people. A sudden increase in psionic ability could induce a psychotic break, but Spectres aren't the monsters we were led to believe. Nova lied to us. Jim, I hear that we're working for the Dominion now. Is that true? We've got a chance to take on Kerrigan, and maybe, just maybe, set things right. The devil himself could offer me that deal, and I'd still take it. That's what worries me. Just don't lose sight of who you are. That's what's important. A lot of people are counting on you, and I'm one of them. I can't believe it. That recording proves it's all true. Mengsk, Tarsonis, all of it. What will you do now? Tell the people. Every man, woman, and child in the Dominion needs to know what their beloved Emperor is capable of. The backlash will be awful. There'll be riots and uprisings everywhere. But that's just what you want, isn't it? It's a start. We sure gave Manx a kick in the pants! Excuse me. I don't usually have outbursts like that. I can't believe those Dominion scientists were hybridizing Zerk and Protoss. That's just... madness.